The Drums Alive was brought to the school this year and it was something that Mrs. Johnson and her sister had created and designed and Camille Cottle, our uh, PE teacher, has brought it into effect and it's been really good supporting the um, instruction that's going on in class. For example, in third grade they start learning their multiplication tables and we learn that that is simply skip counting and one thing that the Drums Alive helps them to do besides working themselves out really well and getting that physical aspect, they learn to skip count, they learn their multiplication tables, they learn how to count by how they will tap the sides of the ball and tap their sticks. So it's been really good in supporting our instruction in class. I love that each kid has a ball, no matter who you are, if you're athletic or not, everybody can drum, everybody has a good time, and I kind of trick them because they think it's just playing and in reality they're getting their heart rate up and they're learning math. When you start young, then you're able to pick up those skills better than if you wait till you're 30. We develop those neurological pathways and that's why we're trying to increase brain body health, if you will, and all these crossover patternings, um, um, de developing, I guess, if you will, hemispheric um, synchronization between the right and left sides and those skills will come some take longer than others but it's everybody can learn those skills. Okay, number sense is the foundation for math computation and with the kids it's best that we break it apart depending on their age ones is above their head, tens is on top of the ball, hundreds is on the sides, and the thousands is on the ground. And in kindergarten, we're more concerned with just basic you know, number sense, patterning, ABC patterning, those kinds of things. But as the kids progress in school, we increase the intensity of, of the representation of the number sense. But if kids can be successful with number sense, then generally they'll see themselves as a mathematician, they think it's fun. And when they're in the classroom and you're trying to teach, okay, 48 has four tens, and eight ones, they think back on their experience in the gym, oh that's simple, that's just four tens and um, eight ones and it makes it really easy for them and normally that's a pretty abstract concept to teach but this makes it more concrete and it makes them feel it in their body and that's the cool thing about it. What we're trying to do is add cognition to whatever we're doing, whether it's fitness or whether it's in school, that we have a combination of body and the mind combining them together with rhythmical applications. Taking that sense of what we learned as children and putting it into a concept that can be um, not only for the brain and not only for the body, but bringing them together.